guys. Welcome back to the house of Higashi. I'm Mrs. Higashi. And I'm Mr. Higashi. And we are going to continue with our week of bug projects. Mrs. Higashi, what are some art activities that you can do with the younger kids down in your classroom? Thank you for asking. We just did a project that goes along with the Very Hungry Caterpillar book. It's a little caterpillar on a leaf. And I think that we're gonna get started on the project right now. All right, guys, This is these are the items that you're gonna need for your project. So I've got a white piece of just copy paper. I have a red and green piece of construction paper, uh, scissors, a green crayon, black marker, glue. I have a glue stick and white glue. And then I found for the antenna, I found some cardboard that I can cut into the antenna and it just happens to be an old paper towel thing here. So that's the first thing that we're gonna do is draw a leaf on our white piece of paper. I take my black marker and I make the shape of a leaf. Uh, Mr. Higashi made his and I made mine. We have two different leaves here. Uh, and after you're done doing that, you kind of fancy it up to make it look like a leaf. You want to make it as big as the paper because our caterpillar is going to take up the whole space. After that, we're going to start coloring our leaf green. All right, so once it's all colored, you're gonna wanna cut your leaf out. I have the big scissors. I have the small scissors. Here we go. Mine's a lot more complicated than yours. I see that. Mine, mine will be swift. But mine will take a lot to cut out. Now for the little ones, um, you wanna make sure that you have an adult helping you in case you have some trouble cutting. I need an adult. <laughs> All right, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our construction paper. We're gonna fold it in half. There we go. Do you wanna do that one, Mr. Yeah. Higashi? I'll fold, I'll fold this one in half. And then, you open it back up and you see this line here. We're gonna cut a line right down the middle. I'm gonna give you one green piece. Oh, thank you, you can have a red piece. Thank you. Now what we're going to do is cut our green piece into four strips. Four strips? as equal as possible. First one's a little bit thinner than the other ones. That's okay. okay. All right, one, two, three, four. Ichi ni san shi. And don't forget one red strip for his head. Got it. All right, so next what we need to do is lay our strips out. And what you're going to do is take a glue stick or uh, white glue and you're going to glue the end of the strip and twirl it around like this. And squeeze, squeeze, squeeze to make a circle. And you're gonna do that for all the rest of the strips. How long should I hold it? Uh, for white glue, I would hold it for about 20 seconds. Got it. All right, once we have all of our circles, we are gonna start placing them on our leaf. So you and I are going to share this, Mr. Higashi. That's fine. I'll and share. sharing is very important. Very important. Very important. So I'm going to start putting my circles right next to one another on the leaf. Yeah, it kind of looks like a caterpillar's body. Exactly. All right, so for the antenna, we are going to take our cardboard pieces that we got from our uh, 
to or paper towel, paper towel tube, and uh, we're going to make the antenna. So we're going to cut two little strips to make the antenna. So after that, it's okay. We're going to take a sharp pencil and poke a hole at the top of the red circle. Poke two holes. <laughs> Looks kind of like eyeballs right now. I know. Just be real careful. There you go. And then what we're going to do is you're going to take your little strips that you made and you're going to kind of get them in. I know it's going to be a little difficult. You might have to make the holes a little bigger with the pencil, which is fine. Could also use parents' help if you needed it. Definitely. And there we go. Do they want to curve forward or backward? I think either way is fine. Whatever you want. I like it. Look at that. Oh my gosh. He's so cute. He is adorable. All right, so the finishing touches. Let's put a little face on our hungry, hungry caterpillar. All right, we're back and we have now, Mr. Agassi, what are you doing? I'm very, very hungry. Like the Sorry. hungry, hungry caterpillar? That's right. All right, so. Ah, uh, here are our finished hungry, hungry caterpillars. Mr. Higashi's looks like he might be a little grumpy and mine is very happy. So that is the end of our project for today. Uh, make sure to, if you make one at home, if you can post it and show everybody else, that would be great and stay tuned for tomorrow's video. It'll and bug-tastic.